Hey there, everybody. Fat here, and welcome to Fat Plays Neon Abyss from Vwu and Team 17. Neon Abyss is a side scrolling roguelike shooter. Eh, kind of like a side scrolling Binding of Isaac, if Binding of Isaac had a uh, neon Greek theme to it, which I think is a pretty interesting combination. Full disclosure, I am playing on the beta, the newest beta for the game, because uh, the regular branch right now has an issue with controllers, and I'm using a controller because I want to use a controller. My friend, the enemy of my enemy. I'm Hades. Titan group took most of my powers and destroyed your family. I need fighters like you to put an end to Titan's reign. Have a drink. If you seek revenge, drink it. I don't know if I seek revenge, but I will drink it. Oh, Nelly. And thus does our adventure begin. All right, we start with a gun. It's pretty great. All right. So we got the tutorial first. I like the neon Greek theme, by the way. It's really neat. It's basically Greek statues with, you know, neon around it. Jump with the button, left trigger. Longer you press it, the higher you jump. To a certain limit, unfortunately. All right. Go through things. Aim and shoot with the right stick. Which seems like a dangerous combination, but I don't think it is. I love the, um... Get out of here, get out of here, you enemies. I don't plan on getting hurt by regular enemies in the tutorial, though the boss may surprise me. All right. Hey, give me that. Give me that coin. Okay, coin. I like the Metal Slug style of if you're close to something, you melee it instead. It's wonderful. Active items will grant you special powers. Most of them cost crystals to use. Upper left, by the way. Hearts and crystals. Upper right's map. Bottom left is uh, grenades, keys, and money. And this is Terry. He's a cat. There are fish bones all over the place. Interesting spread attack. Also, active item. He gives me a balloon! But I can use the fly. And then I could unlock this with a key. And that is a lot of grenade. And a heart. Very nice. Very nice, I think. More grenades. Very nice. Very nice. You need more practice to master throwing bombs. I don't know, dude. Seemed pretty easy to me. Also, if you hold it now... Oh, yeah! This wasn't actually in the non-beta version. They give you a trajectory. That's nice and helpful. Big old coin. Ten coins. What is this gun? White Fox. Charming and dangerous. If you use the active ability, it fires an energy but Whoa! Does that do damage? Because if it does, that's awesome. Eggs. Eggs will hatch into different pets as your adventure continues, though the process doesn't always result in a success. Good to know. And here's a random room, just so you know it's a random game. It does do damage! Yo, I'm digging this! And this is the boss room, where we fight George, the god of pills. Alright, let's take him on! Oh, come on, buddy. I'm gonna have your number. He just does a triple attack, it looks like, on first glance. Woo! Now, oh god, he's got a mohawk. Okay, you can see the uh, sparks where he's gonna land. Oh boy. Does this, how much damage does this do? Ah, not enough to, not enough to be worth half a heart to test. Uh, yeah, it's not, that's not that much. Regular shots, I think, are doing more. He's jumping, he's coming down. I'm shooting, I'm scooting. I did not scoot fast enough. Okay, here we go. Pop that little dude. Yeah, the stars are doing a lot more damage themselves. So let's not even worry about the other. Okay. Ooh, they chase enemies a little bit too, it looks like. Or they stick to them or something. Either way, it looked cool. You're dead. We got a yellow crystal. We got half a heart. We got a coin. And we got a soul flask. You hear whispers within the bottle. Add a heart container and recover some hearts. Oh, well, that's good. Cool, let's enter the portal and go into the first proper level. Some items might not look useful at first glance, but they all have a purpose. Simple rule, more is always better. Good to know. Alright, now we're properly up in this game. So let's see what we have to explore. Enemies! Ah, there's, thank you for the crystal. Apparently it costs two crystals to use the special ability of this thing. Which I've already forgotten what it was. Don't worry, I'm sure it's not that important. Oh boy. 
Yeah, it looks like it kind of tracks enemies, but not really. I don't know. Let's get rid of these dudes so we can move on. And actually, I can open up my inventory by pausing it here, and then I can see fires an energy ball. Okay, we might save that for the boss once we find him. Alright, teleport. Looks like we need some keys to enter this room, and this is an arena, and we would need to grenade this thing. Which, we have a lot of grenades, so I say let's do it. Let's see what we got going on here. Come at me, dudes! Give me that thumbs up! Hell yeah! Oh no, oh no, there's a lot of... Oh, oh, oh! Yes! I knifed one of them right in the face! As opposed to wherever else you'd knife them, I guess. Okay, go up that bomb. Okay, these are... I... These are a certain type of enemy. I think they were called cell types. They usually aren't that dangerous unless you attack them and then they get mad. Like little weirdos. Imagine getting mad at getting shot at. Alright. I don't want to kill this guy. He's just grooving, man. Look at him. Just having a hell of a time. I have to come over here like a jerk ass and shoot him in the face and so he's just going to poop out triangles at me. You know, I feel like the jerk now. And these guys are going to make me feel worse. Okay, we got rid of the shooter. And these guys explode on death, which is good to know. So let's try to just keep a distance from them as we give them the oofen. Boom! All of them pop. We got an eight ball. Blocks enemy bullets. It's from the egg. It hatched into an eight ball. All right. And this is a smithing hammer. Clang, clang, clang. Upgrade your weapon. Increase weapon damage. Yo, we got three tails now. Nice. Six health. All right. That means they can die, which is good to know. But I guess you can keep getting more pets. Kind of the trade-off, you know? I guess I could have teleported back, but... You guys like seeing me walk, right? It's the most exercise I ever get, and I only get it in video games. Three free eggs? I'll take them. Can't wait to see what they hatch into. I think the egg system is very neat. I like this concept of, uh like a bunch of temporary allies like super temporary okay they teleport and then they yeah this should be easy enough if my weapons could reach them <laughs> makes it a little bit harder there we go one down come down here or don't you know let's do that that works too iron windmill deals damage when it touches an enemy on death i get three angry sprites all right let's go jump up here Bust that. Get nothing out of it, but it's okay. Yo, a chest on a chest. Do we get both of these if we unlock it? Because that would be... Could be nice. However, there is an item room I haven't unlocked yet. So, that thing you see there. If I attack it, it could be a bad thing. If I don't attack it, it could be a good thing. Flower! Spits bullets at enemies automatically. On death, damages all enemies in the room. Nope, oh, I damaged it. Damn it. So now it's stuck here, but if I hit it... I think I get something out of it. Yeah, yeah, I get this thing over here in the bottom right. It's like a violence meter? I'm not 100% sure what it is. Oh, boy. Blow that boy up, yeah. I don't like the laser. Yeah, I think if we stay up here, we avoid the laser, though. Alright, I could throw money into this for a chance to get past. How much does it cost? Five coins? We'll try it. Hey! Nice! Give me that egg. Give me that heart. That's all you're giving me? I'll take it. Another teleport room. Next to the boss. Alright. Go ahead and do that. And then I actually wanna... Uh, wanna pop this open. Can I do this? Yeah, yeah. That should do it. There you go. A shield! Oh, and there's another one inside. Okay. I see how you're doing. Oh, you jerk. Ah, you jerk! Alright. There you go. Bunch of crystals. Song of Joy. Is it upgraded? It is. Okay. Well, wait. Okay, it is. Most important thing in life is to be happy. You can fly in the current room if you decide to spend three crystals on it. It pops into smaller ones? Interesting. You know what, let's take this into another room to test it out. And then we can decide if it's something I want to take to the boss. 
We did kind of use all of our grenades in that last room. That was kind of a mistake. Oh, boy. Okay, I mean, so far it's interesting. Damage seems to be on point. And watching them bounce everywhere is nice. A blue brick. It blocks bullets on death. You get a chance. You have a chance of getting another blue brick. Doesn't seem that great. I would love a key. Please. There's a lot of reasons I would love a key. But the bottom line is I would love a key. Alright. I hate... Dude, so many games do this where the enemy's bullets can all fly across the room, but almost none of yours can. Cactus Baby! She causes damage to anyone she touches. Thank you, Cactus Baby. I appreciate you, and I want you to know that. Oh, thanks for the other crystal as well. Being able to fly could help in certain rooms. Can't deny that. It is expensive, though. All right, well, I don't have anything needed for getting in here, which would be... Well, I do have a grenade. And this I can get in with three crystals? It is a shop. We'll, we'll open it just to see what's inside. I mean, brave cookies, the messenger gun, a key. I feel like I probably shouldn't do this, but I'm going to do it. I'm not spending the key to get in that room. I'm spending the key to get into the item room. Where I will hopefully get an item. And by which I mean I'm guaranteed. What is this, a donut? Hard mint! Every time your pet evolves, you'll drop half a shield. Ooh! Well, that tells us two things. One, pets can evolve. And two, that's a good thing. Alright, teleport over here. There's at least one more room left, which might be enough room for a pet to evolve. Or it's a gun. Okay, a free gun. Swallow. Close your eyes. Increase your weapon damage in the current room with the active button. It's just longer range. But we could use this as a boss killer. I kind of want to try it. But at the same time, I really like the bouncy effect of the other weapon. I think I'm going to keep the doot doot. The song of dooting. Also, do I have mint mouth? I think I have Mint Mouth. I hope that's a good thing. <laughs> Although, I know it's not. Okay, let's take on the second boss. Chain, the god of Bittercoin. Oh, boy. Oh, God, he just blew up in my face, dude. We have a disappearing... Disappearing platforms. Good to know. Okay, he should be going to another... Yeah, he's going to another, his other form now. Oh, he sucks! Oh, God, he sucks! He sucks hard! But, oh, God, I took some dumb damage there, but... We only lost half a heart. Oh, one of them didn't hatch into anything. Got a shield. Got another artifact thing. We got a beast amulet. Raw, raw power and passion, but hard to control. Your rate of fire is increased... Wait, reduced? You read that again. Reduces your rate of fire, but greatly increases your weapon damage. Oh! So basically, we have bigger balls. Giggity. Let's go. I like bigger balls. Wait. Don't quote me. Level three. Here we go. Give me another key, because I want that item room again. I also want what's in there. That's not a key. That's a free item. Chocolate cookies. Every time your pet evolves, you'll drop a bomb. And we get a nice swood hat. All right. Very cool. Is this... Is that supposed to be the Willy Wonka bowler from the, the, the bad version? I don't want to be the bad version of Willy Wonka. I want to be Gene Wilder. I, I mean, at least let me be Waco Kid. Come on. Ah, that was some bad damage. That was also some bad damage. We got a snowboy. He can throw a snowball which freezes enemies. I'm not going to lie. I kind of lost track of myself there. I don't really think it's worth it to pop myself on that again. Dude, I was gonna say, I wanna break the box. Alright. This is some decent damage it's doing. Problem is, it doesn't bounce forever. So I need to, like, get the high ground. Cactus Baby 2! That means crystals and bombs and armor! Wait, when do I get crystals out of these? Anyway... Cactus Baby 2. He's a better baby. He's got, she's got a hat. And she fires bullets randomly and they penetrate. It's pretty great. I like everything about that. Thank you for the free 
20 coins? Nice. And it's a teleport room. All right. I assume some of those things over there... Some spaces, like this one, I think, which looks like it has extra room behind it. I'm assuming that it will eventually hide a secret room, but we don't have access to secret rooms yet. Okay, as soon as that guy gets sees us, he's going to be launching some bad stuff our way. Oh! Killed the magician. He wasn't that tough. Hey, can you do me a favor and blow up? Thank you. Got a couple of crystals out of that. This is a good time to remember that we can fly, which means if you would freaking die. There you go. Aw, you failed. Give me the balloon. Get me up here. Get these for free instead of spending a grenade. Give me these free crystals. Uh, money, please. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful. And yeah, I assume we lose the bomb between, or the balloon between rooms. Which flying wouldn't help us here anyway, because we would need to use grenades to open this up. If I get one more, I'll use it. But until then, I won't. That's just how I'm going to do. You can't stop me. Okay, before we move on to a different room, let's go ahead and activate the teleporter, because you have to activate them. Let's see what's over here. Enemies. Enemies. Oh, that's the purple-headed bear. That's the tough one. Okay. No worries, though. We're strong. We got this. Oh, thank you, Cactus Baby. Saved my life there. Tiny mummy. You can block bullets and may fire too when attacked. Also an egg. You got a lot of eggs. You got a lot of followers. Dude, this game is very follower heavy. I'm digging it. I'm digging the follower heaviness because they're, you know, they're nice little dudes. I mean, it's a baby cactus creature. What's not to love? You stop hanging out on the roof. Get down here, where the real fight is. All right, that works too. Here we go. Cactus Baby 3, look at that hat. On death, fires a huge amount of penetrating bullets. And that's also a grenade. That is a shield for us. That's a lot of good stuff, baby. All right, teleporter. Boss room, we found it. I don't know what that sack is. Whoa, jeez. I thought you could blow this one up. But it doesn't blow up on impact, so maybe you can't. Maybe I got it twisted. Either way, we got a key. And we got crystals, which means I could afford the... Yeah, let's, let's do this. I know I'm losing out on the item room, but this could be worth it. That was not worth it. Unless the shop costs crystals. Then it'll be worth it. Alright. Well, we'll find out. Okay, gotta get that, dude. He was just chilling, unfortunately, but... Chai! Jeez! I jumped into the bullet. That was a terrible way to lose health. There we go. Yeah, yeah, get him. He's goofing. Snow, brother! Throws two snowballs, which frees enemies. Which means uh, we get a lot of shield, dude. And another grenade. All good things. That hopefully do not come to an end! Oh my gosh! Little dude came out of nowhere. Scared the hell out of me. Mummy number two. He can block bullets and may fire four when attacked. And then when he dies, you drop half a heart. What am I surrounded by? What is going on? What are these balls? Oh, are these little hate balls from the eight ball breaking or whatever it was? Something broke and gave us these balls. Look, stop goofing on me, okay? When I'm saying things like breaking balls. Thank you. Thank you for your support. This map is huge. Keys. That's not keys, but okay, I'll take eggs. I will usually take eggs. Ah, dang it. Taking the dumbest damage. Okay, get that little dude. He's gone. Alien baby fires a heat-seeking bullet at enemies automatically. So he's pretty darn good. I will totally trade one of these for a key. Okay, we're keyed up. It's nice. It's a nice feeling. And we're armored up. Also a nice feeling. Blow that boy. There he goes. Blow this boy. Blow him good. Mm, there he goes. Little bear. He fires a bouncy bullet. Hey, I do that. Yeah. 
I have something in common with Little Bear. We both love Little Bouncies. Little Bouncy Jubblies. Okay. All right. Well, we could use that. Ah, there was a chest in this chest. Okay, let's spend crystals to open the shop because we have 93 buckaroonies. I can get a new gun, but I don't want to do that. Immortal Heart sounds pretty good right now. Legendary Trophy you can revive after death can only be used once. I think that makes sense. Can't expect too much. We do have a key for this, but do we know where the item room is? We do. It's way back in the beginning. Let's get the item room because we know what's in here. It's an item. The hell is that? Elastic gel? Cool! Victory of science. Your bullets will randomly rebound when it hits the wall. They already do that, dude! This is literally what they already do! Alright. I guess that means I can change my weapon for free now. Oh, that's right. I need a, another grenade to... Hey! Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. There's grenades in this room? I missed a grenade? I did, and a shield. Little dude must have upgraded and I missed it. This is good. Good for Bitcoin and good for me. Alright, there's also a lot of crystals lying about that I'm going to want to pick up. But we'll try to keep one grenade in hand, you know? I think it's worth doing that. Wait, is there something up here? No, okay. Oh no, that's right, we need two grenades for that area. I don't want to spend that. I don't want to spend it, I refuse. I refuse to play your games. Give me my crystals. Are you actually joking me? I would need to spend a crystal to gain three crystals. I'm actually feeling bamboozled by that. It's literally not worth it. All right. Let's go to the boss room. Whoa, whoa, this is back? Didn't I open this already? What the? That's weird. All right, another crystal. Again, I'm not spending three crystals to get one more crystal. Let's see who's in the boss. Uh, Colt, the god of guns. Gun boy! I think I know what his weapons are gonna be. Okay, his weapons mounts too. It's so... There's so much going on right now. All I can do is hold here and hope that I'm not in a strike vector zone. His, his bullets do not bounce off of... His bullets disappear when they hit him. This is good to know. Oh, jeez him. Whatever he's dropping, we can break him with bullets. They're bombs, I think. Alright, I think we're well equipped for this fight. As long as we... Uh-oh, that's not... Oh, they're homing! He's got homing weapons! It's okay, he's nearly dead. And we still have plenty of armor. Tiny Mama 3! Blocks bullets, fires 8 bullets when attacked. On death. What is this? Drops a heart? A full heart? Nice. Evolution means more grenade. Medal of Honor increases movement speed and weapon damage. Nice. Let's go. Keys are valuable. Try saving at least one for item rooms. I'd love to, game. Thanks, game. Alright, well, there's a shop. We could spend three crystals to go to it. Not worth it yet. So instead, let's spend uh, two minutes to go over here, get chased by explody enemies, and uh, feel bad about ourselves. Alien Baby X fires two heat-seeking missiles automatically. Okay. Good stuff. Sack full of... Wow, that's a lot of money. <laughs> Put us at 70 right away. That's actually enough to make the shop worth it. Let's see if we can find some crystals lying around. Don't know if we can, but... If we do, it could be worth it. That's all I'm trying to say. Alright, I'm surprised all my little dudes are alive, to be honest with you. And the enemies seem to be getting a lot stronger per round. Little Panda! Fires two bouncy bullets automatically. Uh, are you trying to tell me that pandas are more involved versions of bears? Because I'm not entirely sure I agree with you. But I'm also not sure that I don't agree with you. Alright. So, we found the boss room. That was pretty easy. 
What's over here? A battle. I see. That's a laser. That's a laser. I'd rather not get hit by it. Oh, jeez. I did not see that guy above me. Oh, and I shouldn't have taken damage from him either, but I did. Oh, failed hatching. Crystal's good, especially since I'm going to want to pop a balloon here. Hey, an egg, too. Nice. Oi! Give me the key. Let's not use the key there, because we can use the key for the item room later. Oh, he poops out bombs. Okay, good to know. But didn't mean to open that thing up, but I did. You can throw crystals in it otherwise, from my understanding. Iron Windmill, hey, you're back. Oh yeah, we got your angry sprites before. Might as well try it. Nope. Try again. Come on, buddy. Big money, no whammies, we got it. All you need is three of anything. And, you know, go ahead and sacrifice ourselves on this. We almost got the bar filled up. Alright, what is in here? Another one. Alright, this one would be worth it. Because we can use the grenade. Plus, a shield is worth it as well. Come on, second time's a charm. You've always done me solid. You jerk. Third time's a... That works, too. Uh, I just want to... I just want to blow up you. There you go. Hey, a key! Beautiful, beautiful. It's exactly what I wanted in this life. Uh, we can use a key to go into the challenge room. You know what? That is an item, so let's do it. Alright. It... Ah, I don't even know what hit me that time. I was not paying attention to the... Right! Oh, okay! His... His weapons stay on the floor and they roll. I see. Right now, this feels like a safe spot. Safe-ish. No, it's not a safe spot anymore. I gotta get rid of the shooters first, if I can. Okay, there we go. Now, now I feel safe again. And now I don't. I made the wrong enemy mad. Now I'm losing health. I'm not merely losing my shields. Okay, cactus baby. We got a new cactus baby. That means the old one died. Did we just get keys out of that? Ugh. Dang it. I don't know if those can hide something or not, okay? Look, if there's tinted rocks in this game, don't tell me about it. Hey, health back. Thanks. You knew. You knew Neon Abyss, and I appreciate that. Alright, I'm missing a coin. There you are. Alright. Well, you know, I'm actually going to walk back through these rooms. Because it says I'm missing chest. And I got a lot of keys. I got a lot of grenades now. So let's use some of them. Ooh! What the hell is this? Infinite key? Well, yeah, this key, you can unlock anything for free. Expires at the end of the level. Oh, baby! Oh, darling! Oh, honey, my child! Frick, I need a crystal. Hopefully this one has a crystal in it. Somewhere. Ha-ha-ha! <laughs> okay. Bam! I hurt myself. But I got another shield out of it, and we got full crystallization. It's free! And we got a partial refund. Yo, this is sick. This is awesome. And another crystal. And a group of crystals. We can fly all day, dudes. Plus, we left the shield back here. Because I guess I'm just the dumbest man. Wait, what? That was a little weird. Okay, actually, no, let's go back the other way. Heck yes. Are you open again? No? Okay. I don't know how you work, you little sack. Could spend crystals to go up to the shop. Well, he just had a gun sitting over here. All right. There's a chance you might fire a laser. Active. Drop random pickups. Cost some coins. I mean, that is a laser, but I kind of like my bouncy boys a little bit more. But would I like the random pickups? 
Wait, no, no, no. Drop it. Okay, there we go. 20 coins. Let's see what happens. That is not worth 20 coins. When you said some pickups, I was expecting literally any number greater than one. So when you gave me one, I was sad. Uh, another gun. Rebel. Slayer of Demons. Yeah, I want to become that. Kill enough enemies and you'll get crystals. Cool. Did it give me horns? It sure as hell did. I'm looking and feeling like a pretty swoot dude today. Give me my bucket of crystals. And let's find out what's over. Really? I gotta go up here to find the path down. All right. Let's do it. Oh, hey. How you doing, Spikes? Not a fan. All right. Not a fan, but easily enough conquerable. Patching failed. That made me sad. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Uh, you could technically make this easier just by popping that, but yeah, that worked. Stop hurting my dudes! Don't hurt my dudes! Oh, man. I could have lost my dudes. That would have been a tragedy. Yo, how much health do you have? Okay. Snowboy! Hi, uh, Snowboy. How you doing? Welcome back. Where's the item room? There we go. Okay, I was gonna say, where the hell is the item room, dude? Remember, we can unlock everything for free, so... If it... Hello. Hello! Okay! <laughs> Thanks! If it requires a key, I gotta open it. Is this an alien mask? Unknown mask. Nice! I look great. Uh, extravagant... Please. An extravagant crystal mask it can be used as a crystal container and adds a shield because no one wants to hit it. Well, I got a lot of shield now. And I have an extra crystal spot, which is nice. Okay. Looks like we've cracked everything. There's another crystal over here to pick up. I mean, I don't think it's that critical to pick it up. I don't want to walk through the spike room again. Let's just fight the boss. The boss will drop a crystal, right? Probably not. I don't know what that means. Freddy, God of Plushies. Okay. Temporary... Temporary platforms. Alright. Oh boy, he moves fast. He moves very fast. And I am not aiming fast enough to keep up with him. But we almost got him down to half health. You know, our bouncy weapon, thankfully, shoots just far enough. I uh, hear a strange sound coming from afar. Um, I filled up the bar to the bottom left, right. Oh, God, that transformation. Oh, jeez. Threw me way off guard. Way further ow, off guard than it should have, probably. Look, how can I not dodge this? This is like basic level one Toho stuff. There we go. Thank you for the shield. Cactus baby leveled up. Which means we get more shield. Giant barbecue. Trade your IQ for power. Add a heart container. Increase weapon damage, but reduce rate of fire. We've reduced our rate of fire by a lot. Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to leave yet. Because we got that bar filled up. So now if I go to the tele... Yeah! We can go here now. So this is what I got for filling up the bar. That was sacrifice. I've sacrificed a heart container... And Ares will give me either Hot Chili, Like of the King, <laughs> or Samurai Soul. All right, Like of the King made me laugh, so I'm grabbing it. You have the King's Approval. Upgrade your weapon, increase bullet velocity. So now my... I have the biggest balls. Again, keep keep giggling. Uh, and they shoot faster than ever. Uh, not faster. They move faster than ever. We could also trade this out for the Nebula. I mean... Yeah, I can't aim the freaking laser, and that makes it suck, dude. It, it's unbelievable how much it sucks that you can't aim the laser once you fired it. If you could just do that, then it'd be cool. All right. On to the next level. Choosing a difficulty setting that suits your playstyle is the best way to win. I agree, and I think that's generally true and should be followed by all video game players. 
Let's head into the challenge room. Get our butts kicked immediately. All right. Oh, he dropped the bomb. Get rid of the bomb. Okay. There we go. Those bombs didn't stand a chance. Got nothing from the egg, but we got a dove, which is pretty nice. A clay doll. Art is an explosion. There's a chance of killing an enemy will release an explosion from you. Not from my enemies. You know, we got armor. Let's go. It took a whole point of armor. Oh, God, that was not worth armor. Oh, dang, man. That was not worth the armor. Ah. Oh! He unfroze right when I was about to head toward him. Lots of armor there. Ghost, baby! She fires penetrating bullets at enemies automatically. On death, I get protected for a short time. Nice. Okay, we don't have infinite key anymore. Keep that in mind. But we do have one more key. So we have a lot of key. Ah! Yay, yay, we got freaking ballerina on hard. Oh, there's a purple one. I don't know what that means, but it's there. Okay. Good stuff. Cactus Baby 3. Thank you for the shield. Oh, an egg over there. I want that egg. I always want egg. We are running low on little egg babies, so... We need more eggs. Egg babies are love. Egg babies are life. You know this. I know this. Everybody knows this. You just gotta act like it sometimes. I should not have shot that. But I did. I could reactivate the, um... Ah! The deal with Ares, but... So what is the purple one? Athena? That would make sense. Snow brother. My brother's here. Thank you for the upgrades. And by that, I mean the extra grenade. Oop, I didn't know if this was going to be a fighting room or not. That egg? Yeah, that dude dropped an egg. And he probably could have hatched to my destruction, so I'm lucky he didn't. Little bit of money. All right. See, it's too early. I'm too inexperienced with the game to tell what I would want right now. You know what I mean? Like... I want more damage. That should be obvious. But what that correlates to other than wanting to be able to hurt things more, I don't know. Heart locket? Every time you use a key, there's a chance you'll drop extra hearts. All right. That's pretty nice. There's the boss if you want him. I don't know if I do. Oh, oh, oh. I really got to stop just charging into rooms. Really got to stop that. It is not doing me any favors. Also, the little explosions whenever I kill someone are really throwing me off. I don't think I like that item. I don't think it's a bad item. I just don't like it. Ah, this room stank. This room stank hard. Gave me nothing. All right, let's head up here. Ah! Blobs, man! Dude, they nearly killed me instantly! What in the world? I'm dead. I revived because I got the... I have a revive item. And we got an alien va baby. Yeah, that's right. We had this, the immortal heart. Thank goodness we had it too. Because they threw... Oh, God! It's the same blobs again. Dude, they throw me off so hard. Ah! And apparently they do a full heart of damage now. Which sucks. For me. Because I suck at not taking... I just shot that thing, and it now requires health to go through. Okay. Huh. Alright, let's go. I gotta get rid of these things first. Not only because they chase so hard, but because... They apparently do a lot of damage. I don't know if they're doing more than usual, but they do a lot of damage. Hi, little bear. How you doing? Welcome to the party. You little jumping puzzle, will you? For a big old pile of nothing? Thanks, you shouldn't have. Alright, well, I'm not going to spend health to go into sh to the shop. Ooh, I will gain health, though. Thank you. Alright, I think we've explored everything at this point. 
except for the shop that I'm not exploring. So let's do the Argus, God of the Dark Net. Bring in Argus. Uh, Argus. Oh, God. What are these? Do I want to hurt these? Does this hurt Argus? They blow up. Okay, and then Argus appears? Yeah, and then Argus appears. Ah! Oh, jeez. I see. I see! He's throwing out spears. Dude, his positioning is so rough for me. Oh, jeez. Plus the fact that he has a full thing of damage. He's, he's gonna ruin me. I can't... I can't beat him! I don't have the damage output to make up for the fact that I can't aim! Or dodge. Dodge. Aiming was not a problem. Dodging was a problem. All right. Well, we lost. But now we can get upgrades. We can unlock hidden rooms, which is a rule. There will be at least one hidden room on each level of the, ch of the dungeon. Argus. He's the current manager. He's the current target. God of the dark net. There are no secrets on the internet. He has hidden in dark corners to observe and control your devices and your life. All right. Well, let's get let's unlock hidden rooms since we have four of these crystals. Bada bingus, bada dingus. Two more, we can unlock an item pack, Death Believer. Kill enough enemies and you'll drop extra hearts. And a bonus. You'll get these items for free in your next run. Okay, that's cool. Then we would need more to unlock these. Piano room? Walking around this room could create such beautiful music. Alright. Marked stones. Find the stones with colorful marks and blast them open to earn your prize. Okay, tinted rocks. You have to unlock tinted rocks in this game. Awesome. I like the free trial aspect. Hey, how you doing? Alright. You're who I go to to upgrade. Good to know. I can go to the basement or the office. Cool. Here's where I can change the difficulty. I'll stick with normal for right now. How's your day? Pretty good. Thanks for asking. We can dance. 10 out of 10. We'll play again. And here we can change our characters. We got Wade, Anna, Amira, who is fr who's DLC content. Can he Does he have a different dance? He does. All right. This is Amir. He uh, apparently can preview the description of items without picking them up. He will lose a heart container on each level, and he will fly when he has no heart containers. Okay. Saya, a test subject from one of Titan's secret experiments. She's an expert with a katana. She can switch uh, battle forms to arranged melee. And yeah, she can switch between the gun and the katana. She also doesn't start with any items, whereas Amir starts with a grenade. Wade starts with three heart containers, a key, and a grenade. You gotta dance too? Yes, she does. Hands on the hip. Well, hand on the hip. And Anna, a, as Spark's best agent, she's been given the most important mission, carry one key. That's quite a mission. All right. Apparently they have the same dance. Very cool. And then there's a bunch of them we haven't unlocked yet. All right. Then finally, we can go check out this to input a seed. Don't even. Uh, to have a specific run, and we can pray here, but the statue's broken. And if we jump down there, we start another run. So, we're not going to do that yet, because that's going to be it for this episode of that plays Neon Abyss. If you enjoyed it, make sure you let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. So, it'll keep coming. It probably won't stop coming. For now, I'm going to go down to the basement, take a look at our nice little treasure room. Hey, gun. Thanks again for watching. My name is Fett, and I will see you in the next video, my dudes. Cat. Cat gun. Yeah.